Bitnami is basically an app store for web applications, and our goal is to take the top open source web applications and make them easy to deploy natively, virtually, and in the cloud. We started several years ago with native installers. Uh, that was before people were really using virtualization and certainly before the cloud came along. And then as those two platforms became more popular, we started offering the same library of applications across all of those environments. So what makes Bitnami unique is that you can start out with developing something on your desktop and then very easily get exactly the same environment in a virtual environment or on a cloud platform like Amazon. Ubuntu really makes it easier to adopt a cloud computing platform like, like Amazon because not only the freedom of choice that you have, the, how you can configure, how can you adapt the operating system to, to your needs, um, but how easy it, it makes it and, and how uh, things work out of the box. We provide Ubuntu images for all the clouds that, that we support, but we ourselves at Bitnami are heavy Ubuntu users. All of our desktop and workstations are based on Ubuntu and as well as our build system. Thousands of, of new developers are launching applications or launching development environments and starting to build apps in the cloud. It just doesn't make sense from a cost perspective to buy and manage your own servers. When you're approaching a new technology, and the cloud is a new technology for a lot of, of developers, um, every step that you can um, uh, cut or every step that you can make easier, um, that's going to have a big payoff in terms of adoption. We really see the cloud as the future. We think it's inevitable that most applications will be running in the cloud moving forward, and in fact, a huge percentage of them already are. And we think Ubuntu is going to play a very big role in that. The Canonical team has done an excellent job on making Ubuntu work out of the box in, in, in the cloud. So you don't have to spend hours uh, trying to, to figure out how to add those capabilities to, to the kernel, how to integrate well with the deployment process of, of Amazon. It all comes um, built in. In documenting how to do things, in building out examples and proofs of concept, there are a lot of tools like Juju and, and things like that that Ubuntu is developing that a company probably couldn't build out all of those products on its own, but they have this vibrant community of contributors that are really working to further the functionality of Ubuntu in the cloud and make it an even better fit, and I think that will serve it very well moving forward.